A routine is an important pre-serve process and should be simple and repeatable. After the routine, the player should be momentarily stationary in the ready position with weight on the back foot, opposite arm straight, hitting elbow back as far as comfortable, hitting arm angle acute, hitting hand head height. The standing float surf process is broken down into three keys. First, lift should be straight up as high as you can hit. Second, step opposite foot step with the toe straight and a full weight transfer third hit creating stretch shortened cycle rotate hips and shoulders elbow first high contact exhale on contact the same routine and ready position should be used for a jump float serve the rhythm is step lift Step close, for righties, left lift, right left. Leave hitting hand in ready position during approach and jump. Lift should be straight up as high as you can hit, creating stretch shortened cycle with hitting shoulder. Exhale on contact and land on two feet. The main emphasis of a serve is to make the ball float with zero spin. In order to do this, we need to contact the ball with a flat hand and no fingers, no snap or rolling over sideways or under the ball, freeze on contact or drive straight through the back of the ball. In high school and beyond, an aggressive float serve is the toughest ball to pass because of its unpredictability and trajectory. Therefore, float should be the main priority for the development of the youth as well. Under special circumstances, other types of serve are potentially game serves. For example, a one-foot jump float. 